Hi, it's Larry here, Xbox Live's Major Nelson, and I'm here with Richard Irving from the Xbox Engineering Team. Richard, we are here to talk about the Xbox One March system update. That's right, and there's some really big stuff in March. I see right here on the sheet of paper, we are gonna talk about one of the top requested features in the community, screenshots. That's right, uh, screenshots has been a long-standing request and we've been hard at work to get the experience just right for our fans. And so we're finally ready to ship support for screenshots. How does it work? If you remember, we added a Snap Center late last year and you can double tap the Xbox button and see uh, press X to record that. Mm -hmm. uh, now you're going to see that you can press Y to, t to save a screenshot. Great. Uh, what's really neat about this is the way that it works is really kind of cool. Uh, as soon as you double tap the Xbox button, we take the screenshot. I see. Um, and uh, then when you uh, see the, the cue in Snap Center, you just hit the Y button and it will save off the screenshot uh, that we took. I see. And what's cool about this is it, it, you know, some games go into their menu when you double tap the Xbox button. It guarantees that you're taking a screenshot of the scene that you wanted to take the screenshot of. And we'll also have voice support? Uh, that's right. So Richard, what can I do with the screenshots? So we're updating the upload app, which as you know, is where you browse your game DVR clips. Um, it's now going to support uh, your, the screenshots that you take as well. And so once you save a couple of screenshots, uh, you'll see them in the upload app. You'll be able to like, comment, and share from the upload app uh, to your activity feed. You'll be able to share to Twitter. You'll be able to send them in a message to show off to your friends the cool thing that you've been doing. And even cooler than I think all of that is you'll be able to set the screenshot as your background on home. Very, very cool. But I wanted to, you just talked about something real quickly and that's the update to the uh, upload app. And that's a massive, massive update. Yes, there's there's some really cool things coming in a new release of Upload Studio. Uh, green screen, I can do green screen now. Richard, what else do we have in the March update? Uh, well, uh, so we're adding some features to help you uh, make more friends on Xbox Live. Okay. Uh, so if you remember last year, we added the ability to share your real name with specific people. Mm -hmm. uh, you can share it with friends of friends. And in March, you'll now be able to set that you want to share your real name with everyone on Xbox Live to make it even easier for people you didn't know were playing on Xbox Live to find you. So Richard, I see here suggested friends. Tell me about that. Uh, in an effort to, to uh, get you more people to play with on Xbox Live, we're adding uh, suggested friends in the form of people you might know based on people who are following you that you're not following back, people that you've played with recently, friends of friends, things like that. Uh, but we're also adding people to watch uh, based on their popularity in the community, doing Twitch broadcasts, hit game DVR clip creators, things like that. Uh, to help you make more friends on Xbox Live. So uh, some sharp-eyed folks may recognize this is very similar to the feature in the Xbox app on Windows 10. That's exactly right. So it debuted on the Xbox app for Windows 10, um, and we're now bringing the feature to the console. We also have another feature for March that came straight from the community. You can now customize your tile transparency. This way, you can pick how transparent you want the system tiles to be on home when you set a custom background. Richard, great work by the team this month. Thank you for joining us. Thank you. For more details, make sure you hit the wire at news.xbox.com or my blog at majornelson.com. Thanks for watching.